And moving to boys basketball where the Beulah Miners are looking towards their underclassmen to lead them this season and hopefully to their third straight regional championship. Phil Bonatti has more. Beulah found a ton of success making it into the state tournament last year. But with a ton of graduating players, the Miners are leaning on their two returning starters, Jonah Larson and Trey Brand. Well, we've got a good post player, so, you know, we want to use him as much as we can. And then we, again, we have a returning point guard who really does a good job of controlling the game for us, I think. And, uh, can, you know, he's going to have to score a little bit more this year, which he's capable of. Brant and Larson not only bring skill, they bring leadership to the fresh faces on the team. When you see younger guys, they need help with something. Or if a coach can't, if a coach help another kid and you see someone doing something, and give them pointers or help them out. And, but not, uh, the biggest thing is be vocal. With so many new players, staying healthy is essential for the minors to reach their potential. Uh, I try to eat healthy. I try to get as much sleep as I can. And then right in the morning, early 6 a.m., get in the gym, run a little bit, get some shots up, get some dribbles in. Even with the lack of experience, Head coach Jeremy Brandt knows that every class can step up and contribute. We've had six and seven seniors graduate, and we've, you know, we've still been able to overcome that and, and still had good seasons. Uh, you know, we're back-to-back -back Region 7 champions, and we've had a lot of turnover. So I think that's a credit to our younger kids of coming up in the program. They know what is expected of them. And, and, and again, I think it's just a lot of that is that team cohesiveness, too. Reporting for KX Sports in Beulah, I'm Phil Bonatti. Bilo will be back in action on Friday when they take on rugby at the Hoopster Tournament in Minot.